everyone, it's Julie from the Warrenville Public Library in Warrenville, Illinois, and I want to tell you about some really fantastic middle grade fiction books that have come out in 2020, so in the past couple months. Um, there are tons of great titles out there, of course, but these are some of the ones I've enjoyed so far and that are available for you to enjoy on Overdrive or Hoopla on via our warrenville.com website. So our first book is Cub by Cynthia Copeland. It is a graphic novel and it's historical fiction. So it's based in the 1970s when having a female reporter was very rare. But Cindy here really dreams of becoming a reporter. So she finds another female reporter to become a cub reporter for. In the 70s, this was more common. It would be kids who really wanted to be reporters would become what was called a cub reporter, and Cindy gets this chance. So as she's following her dreams here, she's also just a 12-year-old girl. She's dealing with friends and crushes and bullies. So it's a great read if you are a fan of Smile or Sisters, those kinds of books. You may enjoy Cub. Um, if you are interested, you could find it as an ebook on Overdrive. Okay, our next book is the first in a series that I'm super excited about. It's called Winterborn Home for Vengeance and Valor. Pretty intense name already by Allie Carter. And it is a mystery book. It is a realistic mystery. We have April here. She's an orphan and she's bounced around to different foster homes and orphanages and she finds herself at this Winterborn home, which used to be an estate for this billionaire family. And most of this family died in a shipwreck, except for Gabriel Winterborn, the son. So April finds herself in this Winterborn home, which is a house full of many secrets. She had no intention of finding the missing and presumed dead Gabriel Winterborn, billionaire and owner of the state, as he is preparing for his own vengeance. So it's a great story, kind of like Harry Potter, where it's these kids who are coming together to try to defeat the evil forces at work. You can find this book on ebook format on our Overdrive. The next book is for animal lovers, A Home for Goddesses and Dogs by Leslie Connor. It is realistic fiction, so it could happen in real life. It is a heart-wrenching book. You're going to feel so many emotions. You're going to feel sad and mad and happy. It's a beautiful story of friendship, family, grief, and protecting animals. So we have Lydia here, and her mother has just passed away, and she has moved in with her aunts in Connecticut, and they decide to adopt a big new dog. It is not a good dog, and Lydia is not a dog person. But as Lydia creates her own space with the paper goddesses her and her mother used to make, and attempts to train this really bad dog, the town begins to gradually pull her in regardless of how much she may resist. Our next, and that book you can find on Hoopla and Overdrive, either as an ebook or an audiobook that you can listen to. So lots of ways to read that one. Our next book is another realistic fiction, sort of crime too, from the desk of Zoe Washington by Janae Marks. And Zoe here, she grows up not knowing her dad. And until her 12th birthday, when she receives a letter from him, which seemed very random to her, her father has been in jail for a crime that he says he never committed. Could he be innocent or is he lying to her? So in the meantime, Zoe is working on her passion of baking but she's also struggling with this new mystery about her father that is available on both Hoopla and Overdrive ebook and audiobook. So tons of ways to read this one as well. Okay, When You Trap a Tiger by Tay Keller. And I just love this cover. I know you're not supposed to judge a book by its cover, but this one does not disappoint. Awesome cover, awesome book. 
So it's based on the power of stories and how much they can impact a person's life. It's magical realism. So it's sort of like a real life story, but with magical elements thrown in. So, and it's also based on Korean folklore about magical tigers that Lily grows up hearing you should never make a deal with a, fire, with a tiger because it is very tricky. So what happens when Lily decides to try to make a deal with the tigers to save her grandmother when she realizes her grandmother stole from the tigers years ago? When You Trap a Tiger is available on Overdrive via ebook or audiobook. And our last book is by a super famous author, Pam Munoz Ryan. It is her new book, Manana Land, Tomorrowland. It is realistic fiction with uh, touches of fantasy, so a little bit of fantasy here and there. It is a really touching story. You have 12-year-old Maximiliano Cordoba, and he always thinks his tomorrow would be in his dreams of becoming a great football player, soccer player, like his father and grandfather. But he finds out for others, tomorrow looks very different. As he hears through his legends that his boilo tells him about a mythical gatekeeper who guides travelers to their tomorrow land. His tomorrow brings him a new journey he was not expecting to seek answers about his family secrets and his missing mother, uncertain of what his tomorrow land might bring. So that one is available on Hoopla Audiobook. So those are just some of the great books you can find. I hope one of them piqued your interest. Once again, if you go to warrenville.com, you can find Hoopla and Overdrive and try out one of these great books. Thank you. Have a great